Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another episode of The Daily Plunk, brought to you today by post-work, post-stress, tired, whatever you want to call it. Whatever it is. <laughs> um, hopefully today... Which I believe is either... No, I, I think I said it in the last one that it was 98, and then it was 97, and then it was 96. Whatever high number of 90 this is, closing in on 100, I don't believe this is number 100. And in fact, I will check that afterwards, or during, or something. But I'm hoping that this goes relatively well, and then we'll see if we change anything up for number 100, because 100 is kind of, I mean, it's kind of weird. I, I, uh, I'm both happy and sad that this small little feature of mine has made it to 100 episodes. Um, some of them better than others, some with potato cam, some without potato cam, some with, um, some characterization, some without. All kinds of different styles. Uh, I find that this is by far, as I've said probably many times now, this uh, three day a week, or in some cases maybe more depending on the, uh, depending on the weather we'll say, um, format, makes, makes for a slightly easier time on on me. Um, I find it easier to process and to be able to play this way. So I'm hoping that as a result of that, um, that we all kind of are fortunate enough to you know, just get rid of that. That's just an accident waiting to happen. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm hoping that. The feature kind of continues, and I don't. The more and more I think about it, the more and more I don't want it to end. I don't. I mean, it's extremely infuriating. Um, it's it. This is not by any means an easy game. Having added the mod to the game, I would argue probably didn't help the. Uh, the difficulty level all that much. Although I I don't get the sense that it made it completely awful. I mean from what I understand from how things have been kind of going is like this could be worse. Quite honestly if I had been the type of person where I was playing Spelunky on the regular. If Spelunky was a uh, was a title that I, I picked up, let's say daily or or weekly, for longer periods of time than just the daily challenge, the uh, daily attempt, I would probably have driven myself mad at this stage because the number of failed attempts, or the lack of progress might be the better way of putting it, would probably be a little bit upsetting, I would think. But whenever you're not really focused on that, I guess, or whenever your focus is more so just these little, these little smidgens of content, it is actually quite a bit more bearable. Um, I did, of course, find that... Oops that the uh, the way I was doing the daily before where I was quite literally trying to do it every day or every weekday was just too much. So I'm glad I moved away from that. I miss that format a little bit at times, but I think it's, it's much better this way. I think overall you guys get to see a less, <laughs> hopefully less, um, stressed out player going through each of these different levels and sections and all that fun jazz and just hopefully you guys enjoy it because I mean 
so long as there's a, even a single view or a comment or whatever on this, I'll I'll probably continue it because it is enjoyable enough. That is something that I I don't foresee getting rid of anytime soon. So yeah, but I would like to improve. That's that's a given. Being able to do better at the daily would be incredible. I mean, just being able to make it through this these first areas through the caves uh, as frequently as we do now is awesome. I, I, I don't know... There's not many... Oh, this is hard for me to describe. In a lot of the many games that I've played over the... Uh, over the years, Spelunky has by far been that one game where, similar to like a Dark Souls or a Demon Souls, which I love those titles. Those are just masterpieces in my eyes. You get the feeling that even when you screw up a whole bunch, that you still did something. And it may not necessarily be a lot of something, but it was, it's something. And I, I kind of, I kind of really appreciate the aspect of that in this title. Just, just the whole, I did something, it turned out okay. I killed that guy from the ceiling where before I probably would let him hit me. Like there's so many little, little accomplishments that it's kind of, it's kind of good in that way I find and I could be wrong I'm sure there's I'm sure there's certain things about it where it's like well you know K-Rack if you did this or if you did that or if you change this or if you change that I'm sure there's strategies that I'm completely ignoring I mean I'm a hundred percent sure there's stuff that I should be doing that I'm not because I mean I haven't sunk the amount of hours into this title that people that really, really play it would sink into it. I, I've, in a way, the daily has allowed me to dabble and uh, kind of test the waters, if you will, of different strategies, of different concepts and ideas, and try some really weird stuff out from time to time, and it just keeps things kind of fresh, kind of unique. So there's definitely definitely some good reason to keep that kind of going. I think. it For me. I'm not going to sit here and tell everybody that's out there pick up this, 2000, I think it's 2008 that Spelunky came out. So 10 years now. I, I'm not going to stand here or sit here or whatever and say, hey, you need to buy or play this game. But I mean, if you have the opportunity to play it, like it's, it's pretty good. It's a pretty satisfying experience. Uh, let's see. Frogman down there. Whoop. There we go. Whoosh. Got him. How would I... Oh, monkey, go away. <laughs> Ooh, it still hit me. I didn't think that it would. I'll admit. Bit surprised by that. I think it was the chest that hit me, not the... Uh, uh, not the... Um, the explosion. Oop. Got rid of him. We go this way, I think, right? Yeah. Clothing stuff. Eh, I could go and get the damsel, but I kind of just don't feel like going back up. Oh, a bee thing. Okay. Fun. Um, let's just start by getting rid of this pond. And see... Okay, that kind of opens up the bee thing a little bit. So, I'm going to try... Okay, that opens it up a lot less than I thought it was gonna. Uh, 
Uh, that was a bad idea of mine. Come on, you. Uh, hmm. Not sure if I want to go that way now. Can I make that jump to that guy? I think I can. Yes. Okay. And then down there. More bombs. They're just throwing bombs at me, essentially. Very nice of them. Okay. Can I... Kind of bust my way through here, maybe? Because if I do that, maybe that'll help. Ah, uh, not entirely. Although, this might actually work. Because I might be able to just get her from here, right? Without getting too much pain in the... Oh, that gave me a lot more health than she ever will. Eight! Dang. Come here, you. Gotcha. Wow. Like, I'm genuinely debating if I actually... Oh. Oh, ghost. Why do you have to be that close? Darn. All right. Man, well, at least we have seven hearts because of the because of the royal jelly or whatever. But I would have liked to have gotten that extra one as well. It would have been it would have been I know it's I know it's very greedy of me, but it would have been nice to have both in a perfect world. Uh, let's see. Oh, she's right here. Um, let's bomb that out, and then maybe if I, whoops, a little too far, oh, not far enough, that's it, there we go. Yes, ropes. Get them ropes. Where's the exit? Over there. Oosh. Um, is that kind of safe? Oh, she fell into it, didn't she? Oh, man. Whoop. Need that shotgun. Nope. See you later. <laughs> oh well we tried we tried uh, okay so I don't have any bombs now so hopefully I can collect some because uh, otherwise this is gonna be kind of risky can I make it over there what? oh Ah, uh, here we go. Oh, no bat. 
No, 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 no. Ah, oh, oh, threw it away. I bounced. I tried to grab the rope because I wanted to get the bat down lower. Ugh. 214. Darn it. Darn it. Anyways, folks, that's today's episode of the Daily Plunk. Um, that is number two... Two something or other. Two... 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 Ninety-eight. Oh, my goodness. So, we're going to hit 100 on the last day of this week. So, check that out for sure if you're interested. Um, I might either go longer or I might do something crazy. Who knows? We'll see. I'll figure it out when I get there. So until then, guys, have yourselves a good rest of the day, and we'll see you guys tomorrow.